Emerging adulthood is a fascinating age where you have many possibilities on which direction your life will go. You have more independence than ever before as you learn how to become an adult. Although you may feel lost at times or on the outside at school, things will get better as you will be able to find your identity in life and become an independent young adult. As an emerging adult, you have a support system around you that can help you get through tough times or give you advice on the many questions that go along with this period. Your culture and the traditions in your family are part of your macro system. Your extended family and the media are part of your exosystem. Your micro system may be one of your greatest tools for advice and support as your family loves you and only wants the best for you. If you do not have siblings or close relationships with your parents, Teachers or friends are always available options to give you that boost you need to make it through each day with a smile on your face, especially students that are from lower income families in an urban setting. Puberty can be a tough time as you may lack the confidence in your body wishing you looked like somebody else. Even though you may look at your body and think I look awkward and gawky or my legs are too small compared to my big head, don't worry. This is normal. It is due to asynchronicity in growth, which means that some body parts may grow faster than others, giving you that look, but it will all even out. You will end up looking like the fine emerging adult you are. Have you ever wondered why you are able to complete your homework and think fast at 8 o'clock in the evening, but are asleep, not hearing a single word your teacher say at 8 in the morning? This is due to the delayed phase preference, which means adolescents are able to perform tasks better later in the day than earlier. Becoming an emerging adult also means you are becoming smarter than you ever have been. You are learning to think abstractly, considering all possibilities and correlations that were not known to you before. However, try not to overthink things and not do something like answer a question in class just because you feel everybody is watching and judging you and you do not want to embarrass yourself. Everybody has these feelings that someone is watching them, which is called an imaginary audience, and they are all going through the same confusing time that you're going through. Being a student in an urban environment means that you are going to have different cultural beliefs than students from rural areas. Living in a rural area may mean that families have to work together around the house and share their responsibilities, while living in an urban city may mean that you have more opportunities to explore your identity as an individual. As an urban student, you should take advantage of this opportunity by finding out where you fit in and forming your own identity. Find friends that share the same values as you and enjoy the same things you do. These friends can help make the transition from being a child to a young adult much smoother. Female students have more opportunities available to them today than ever before. They are able to have the same opportunities in the workplace as males, as well as get an education. However, the media still stresses the importance of being beautiful and appealing to boys, despite all the new opportunities available. As fun as dressing up, shopping, and looking good may be, make sure you focus on your studies and working hard today to create a better future tomorrow. Boys should also focus on academics and learn how to become an independent man. A high self-esteem is vital at this age. As an adolescent, you should always be nice to others so that in turn, they will be nice to you. This way you guys will both feel happy and have the self-esteem necessary to complete everyday tasks with a smile. Studies have shown that a high self-esteem leads to less behavioral issues as well as higher school achievement. This will also help you find your identity at an earlier age. Throughout the country, especially in urban settings, the average age of marriage and childbirth has gone up. This means that families are having less kids than before. It is important as emerging adults that you develop a close relationship with the family you have. Strive to have a buddy relationship with your siblings that you can turn to or talk to anytime. The best teachers to get close to and learn from are the teachers with an authoritative teaching style. They will allow you to express yourself in the classroom and foster creativity, but make sure the class does not get out of hand and that everybody has an equal opportunity to learn. As you develop and make friends, try to avoid being a part of a clique or group that does not allow outsiders to hang with or be seen with them. 
This will only hurt others' self-esteem and end badly for everybody. Studies have shown that people who constantly are rejected and victimized as a child will earn less money as an adult and may turn to unhealthy behaviors to cope with their sadness. Talking to elders can help you resist temptations that come along with peer pressure. Even though everybody else is doing it, including your friends, does not mean it is the right thing to do. Make sure the decisions you make follow the values and morals that you believe in. Stay true to who you are and you will go far.